Here we are at the factory of McConnell's Ice Cream in Santa Barbara, California, just off Milpa Street. Michael Palmer, the owner, well, he's having Santa Barbara Forge and Iron uh, do a lot of the work inside. So we're gonna meet up now to figure out how to invigorate the image of McConnell's Ice Cream. The store's gotta look like the inside, it's like a machine for ice cream, you know, the store. So we want people to feel like the things that make the brand unique. And so, you know, whatever you, know, you end up designing, it's gotta be something that feels of this place. Pretty great. Yeah. Well, all right, it's time to get Tom and Michael's ideas off paper and into reality. We've got a lot of things to do. We're gonna be very busy. We've got a point of sale table. We've got a table at which to eat the ice cream, a menu board, creamer station, the list just goes on. Next step, make it happen. All right, so these tables we're making have some pretty cool bases on them. They're simple, but we really want to bring out the, uh, the texture of the metal and things like that. So again, big theme in this store is repurposed uh, old machinery. Not too old, but just enough to add some texture and grit to the store. So one thing I'm doing to these table bases is uh, heating up one end of the pipe and hammering it over the tapered point of the anvil, which does two things. It stretches the metal. Uh, gives it a, a little bit of a shape, but it also brings out the forged texture on the skin of the metal itself. And as you can see, the flared ends of the metal, it's not an overstatement, but it's just enough movement to the metal to make things be really cool. So at this point in the project, Lance and I are working on these cubes that you see behind me. They're going to be footstools and work surfaces, etc. Anything that they are needed for, they're going to be upstairs in the, in the seating area used for, for anything you need it for. Um, so, we're just finishing up these cubes for McConnell's. Um, as you can see, the wood is now on there. I distressed them a little bit. You know, I took a chain and beat them up, took a torch, flamed them a little bit. Now we just gotta put them together, finish it off with these bolts. And uh, all I did was tighten it a little harder so it'll, it'll sit flush. And there it is. Well, we're beginning the first dry fit, which basically means before we're done, we bring it into the space to make sure it fits. If there's a problem, we'll know about it now before we put the final touches on it. So here we go. Game's on. All right, it's the top of the ninth, and Andy and Troy are working on the last finishing touches on the sneeze guard, which is needed by the health department here, so it's the last little detail we got to get right. SB Forge is doing a great job of attending to our needs. We've been very uh, happy with everything they've done, and once we put it all together, which will be in the next few days, I think everybody's going to be stoked. So, looking forward to it. Here we are, uh, opening night, McConnell State Street, first company owned store in uh, over 48 years. We're a little nervous, but it uh, seems like things are working pretty well. And uh, so come in, have some ice cream, enjoy it. McConnell's Fine Ice Cream, Santa Barbara, California. It's the next era in McConnell's, thanks to Santa Barbara Forge and Iron. <laughs>